to talk about sitting position with the cello and the left hand position. When we sit at the cello, it's very important to have the correct chair. If you see, I am using a dining chair, which has um, a very solid base to it and it doesn't have any arms on it. That's very, very important. So when I sit on the chair, I sit at the front of the chair and I put my feet flat on the floor. And when I pick my cello up, the cello rests in between my knees, rests on my chest with the neck away from my shoulder and the neck of the cello goes to the left of my head. When I put my left hand on the cello in position, you will notice that I have three little stickers on my cello. So it's just as the um, other hand, we have thumb, finger one, two, three, four, or first, second, third, and fourth finger. So thumb, first, second, third, fourth. We put our first finger with this lovely rounded shape as if I've just got a ball in my hand. So we put our first finger on the top spot. That is the one nearest the scroll of the cello. Then our second finger in between the next spot, our third finger on the next spot and our fourth finger on the next spot. So first finger on the first spot, third finger on the second spot and fourth finger on the third spot. You will also notice that there is a gap in between my fingers. That's very important to provide you with the correct tuning. So if I just turn the cello around a little bit, you will see that my thumb is opposite my second finger. You will also notice that I am using the pad of my finger. So we mustn't use the tips of our fingers. We mustn't use flat fingers. So nicely curled fingers. So the pad of the finger and also the hand is away from the neck. We mustn't do this. So the thumb must always remain opposite the second finger. That will keep the hand and the arm in the correct position to play. 